Good afternoon, everybody. I have a daily chart on that NASDAQ Composite Index, and it's going to show you this. We're at a major topping pattern. We've gone up. We've tested these highs and whatnot. I'll draw another trend line. Here you can see where the low was when we started the new year out in January. This diagonal trend line goes right up here to the top. This were the last top that you see right here and right here. The daily chart is overbought. I'm going to show the uh, weekly chart, which is a lot more um, data, where it's going to show exactly why we're going to come down. So right here, we have these top reversals back over here. This is the low in January. We come straight up here in that trend channel, and it is very, very strong. And so Friday, they busted it out and came up and slightly got above the high there. So on Friday, we closed up 27.72 on the actual composite index here. Now when we go ahead and we really take a look at how overbought we are, and one of the things that we're going to show on this is, is exactly where... Um, that likelihood of being overbought, when's it going to come down, how long can it stay overbought, and there's lots of different things. So one of the things that we're going to focus on is going to be the topping pattern on the weekly overbought NASDAQ composite. I'm going to draw a trend line right here, and it's going to go just like this, so we can see here and whatnot exactly why we're testing. It actually got slightly above it. And we are extremely overbought on the NASDAQ composite. The GDP numbers came out uh, on Friday, surprised everybody. Uh, the expiration was going out on the close up toward their highs. Um, when we take a look at the actual uh, trend line from where the breakout was, we'll just go exactly like that. And we're right in here now. And this was last week's breakout to make them slightly a higher high on the NASDAQ composite. But once again, I'm just going to caution everybody. Listen, they always set up when they get really overbought. And we know what happens when they get overbought. It happened over here last year. That did. And then we went ahead and we came straight right down here. And we did. And then we started it off. And we've gone the same distance, a little bit further distance. And we can see how uh, that bull in that NASDAQ composite kept going straight up higher. High frequency trading technologies, there are machines that drive these indexes up. It's not everything that you think about, like people like yourself doing it. No. 80% of the volume is done by algorithmic uh, machines, which are a way for them to uh, jack it to the ceiling. Um, even the bull doesn't find it attractive anymore because we've gone all the way up. Now what's going to happen is, is that there's going to be a move down. They can't stay up here. Fund managers, money managers, they're not that stupid. I don't see them buying in to uh, record highs, which put us in record overbought territory on the NASDAQ uh, composite period. We are coming down. 